on the BBC News Channel. Coming up next, the BBC News at 5. And at 6.30, we'll have the day's sports news in Sports Day. In a world of complex global news stories, we'll sift through the information to bring you what matters most. And with reaction and reporting in real time... Our immigration laws are a laughing stock all over the world. You'll know what's happening around the world as we do. And that these new measures won't actually stop Venezuelans coming over. It'll just make the migrant crisis worse. Whatever the story, we'll piece it together on Outside Source. Join me, Ros Atkins, tonight at 9 on the BBC News Channel. Welcome to BBC News, live from Westminster. Today at five, the Speaker of the Commons, John Burko, refuses a government request to hold a vote on its Brexit deal, saying the question was already put to the House at the weekend. My ruling is therefore that the motion will not be debated today as it would be repetitive and disorderly to do so. Uh, I note the dilemmas you face mean that on occasion you will sometimes have to please some and not others, but it is becoming remarkable how often you please one lot and not the other lot. We'll have all the latest as MPs continue to debate the next step for the Prime Minister's Brexit deal. Also in today's BBC News at 5. Sources in the royal household say Prince William is concerned for his brother Harry after he and his wife, the Duchess of Sussex, open up about struggling to deal with the pressures of being in the spotlight. The biggest thing that I know is that I, I never thought that this would be easy, but I thought it would be fair. And coming up, angry scenes at Stormont as members walk out of the first assembly meeting for three years, paving the way for abortion and same-sex marriage to become legal in Northern Ireland. Hello and welcome to Westminster. It's five o'clock. Our top story, the Speaker of the House of Commons, John Burko, has ruled that MPs cannot vote on the government's Brexit deal today. He's been forced to defend his decision after a number of MPs challenged his ruling. Downing Street says the government is disappointed with the Speaker's ruling and that they would now prefer to go ahead with the introduction of the Withdrawal Agreement Bill. We're expecting to hear the government's legislative plans for the week shortly, but ahead of that, let's just remind ourselves of the day's key events. So, the Speaker has ruled out a vote on Boris Johnson's Brexit deal, saying the motion had already been brought before MPs on Saturday and that it would be repetitive and disorderly to debate it again. This weekend, MPs nodded through an amended motion which withholds approval of the Prime Minister's deal until it has passed into law. The government will publish legislation this evening to implement its EU withdrawal agreement bill, which will be scrutinised by MPs. The withdrawal agreement bill triggers the legal process of the UK leaving the EU. Earlier today, the Court of Session, that's the highest court in Scotland, delayed a decision on whether the Prime Minister has fully complied with a law requiring him to ask for a Brexit extension.